Okay, if you guys did not know, we have been getting terrorized, attacked, and harassed for months. And we're finally gonna do something about it today. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Well, Tucker is going bye-bye, Brandy. Finally. He's attacked me one too many times. I don't know how I feel about it. I feel awesome about it, because you're not gonna be attacking me no more. I mean, hopefully you uh, come with some ladies and not in the frying pan or, or peanut oil. But you know what? It's you did it to yourself. Ours. He did it to himself, Brandy. Yeah, it's not all our he did it to yourself. I kind of want to get him, but I don't want him. He'd run off or him and Bobby fight. We need to pee him. Mm -hmm. All right. Adios. Okay, I just arrived at what I think is going to be the most bizarre auction I've ever been to. So let's go in here and see what we're going to get ourselves into. I don't know how much filming will let us do, but I'll see what we can get into. What's up, Brandon? You already get some animals. You already bought a bunch of stuff. Where's your know. little part at? I just got some pocket knives and some ropes and something like that. What are you I'll, looking... put a, I'll put it all on your number now. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> what, are you, what are you looking to buy today? Maybe a donkey and a llama. Okay. Donkey and llama. So this is what we're after today. It's a peahen, probably two of them. And they got a bunch. But look at all these peacocks they got. Is that not crazy? Tons of peacocks. I'm telling you, this is the most bizarre auction I've ever been to. What's up, buddy? Nice hair, dude. Should have brought Eddie and Chief up here. Oh, that's the one Brandon's got his eye on right there. No, no. Oh. Look at that little guy. You being shy? Boy, they got some skinny necks. Huh? What's up? Don't spit on me either. Why are you staring me down? <laughs> you gonna spit? <laughs> What's up, ladies? He's got a tumor on his back. Whoa, whoa, you don't like that or you do like it?
Easy there. Let's walk over here. What's up? Those uh don't look like fit you. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Now you guys are very bizarre. That's what I'm talking about when I say bizarre auction. Look at these things. Yeah, you're bizarre looking. Sorry. <laughs> Look at it. Oh, this is crazy. Hey. They made friends. So this is the first time I've ever been to this auction. Like I said, this is the most bizarre auction I've been to. They got some crazy animals here. We can't do any filming on the inside in the auction part itself, but out here I think it's okay. They're sleeping. they're selling you guys as a pair whoa oh you're a little bitty ain't you Hey, Big Joe, you're huge. That's the life right there, isn't it? You get to hang out down there and just now you have to move for your food. All the peacocks, tons of peacocks. I like to have it in clothes. Peacock pen at the house, I start raising peacocks for sure. I, I love them. Peacocks were one of my grandma's favorite favorite animals. That's why we got Bobby. To remember my grandma.
There's one like Bobby. That one's like Bobby. Peahens. I'm looking for peahens. All through here, these are all the peahens. I can't see her. Why are you running? Hmm? Well, you know me, don't you? I tried to be friends with you, but you just wouldn't do it. So now you have to go to someone else's home. I tried. I tried. You just didn't want to be friends. So now you gotta go bye-bye. You -bye. turd. These, they got the biggest cages here, I think. There you go. Hope's coming to say bye to you. We raised you from a chick and you just wouldn't quit attacking me, would you? So if you guys are new to the channel, this is our turkey Tucker. He's been attacking me for months. And instead of eating him and dispatching him, we decided to just bring him up here to the cell. And someone else can use him maybe for a breeder or whatever. But he's not making a good pet for us. So yeah, that's Tucker the turkey. That's a big turkey. Okay, we're leaving the most bizarre <laughs> auction we've ever been to. Yeah. Oh, Ma Had Hadley. Mm -hmm. And um, Hopi had her little heart set on a what? Kangaroo. And this one was a kangaroo, but we didn't get the kangaroo. What did we get? We got um, three, I mean, four. two pea hens yeah. and one peacock. Yeah. So we'll go load them up. Hadley, are you going to help? Yeah. Like your outfit, Hadley? Now we'll go get them. Four yeah, we got him for Bobby, but we did get a pe another peacock too because we like the way he looked, huh? Yeah. So we'll show you guys when we get back to the house. Okay, Hope, we're home. I'll put, I'll put it right here for now. So you want to show them what we got? Yeah. So we got, we haven't named him yet. We'll save that for later. Wait, the big reveal. <laughs> so we got this pea hen. She's a three-year-old peach, I think. Um, peacock and, this. and then we got this one. This one's my favorite. Yeah, it's so cool looking. Yeah. It's a silver I, I pied peacock. Was that say peach on it? Um, purple, purple hen laying. That one's the peach. This is laying now. Yeah, that one's laying. It's supposedly bred. So if we get any eggs, we'll put in the incubator. All right, here you go. Did <laughs> they get you? There's mom. Mom's coming. Yeah. She's so cute. Mom doesn't, hey, mom has no idea we bought another peacock. Yeah. Look, there's Bobby. Hi, Bob. Look, there, hey, you guys aren't supposed to get out of there. You guys aren't supposed to go in there. We're checking it out. So cute. Mom, look. A white one? We got a peacock. Look. I know, I said three. Well, you didn't know it was a peacock. We got two pea hens and Are a peacock. Are going to go on? Uh, they should, I hope. Look, Look awesome isn't it looks. pretty? Hey, come here. You're pretty. Hi, baby. Look I at this we'll one. I think we'll just leave them in here for now because we won't have time to uh, okay. take them out. Give them some fresh water. Hi, Bob. Bobby, I got you a lady. So cute. The chicken's out. Yeah, get them out. Here. Hayden, looks pretty cool, don't he? Let her drive up there. No, that's fine. Go ahead. Bobby. I hope that buddy. Lie. Me too. That won't make him fly off a little. No, little. but we got we got a couple ladies. Here. Should we? Should we keep him here? So this weekend, are we building a aviary? We're gonna have to get one soon. So cute. He's awesome looking, isn't he? 
How much wow. were you, sir? So he cost. Oh, no, Bobby was three hundred fifty bucks. I, I think remember. I, I got him. So his brothers, pretty much just like him, they went for almost four hundred dollars. Well, no, I just that was the last one I got for two fifty. Oh. Yeah. Hope so. I like that one. You're pretty. Bite? It's really cool looking. Bite? All right, we'll be back in a little bit, guys. We're gonna unload them, and then uh, we'll be back. You two are exhausted, huh? You're exhausted. You guys were fighting coyotes all night last night, wasn't you? Let's go check on the new peahens. Let's go. Okay, they were out with the coyotes all night last night, chasing them off the place. Uh, but you guys, it's been a few days since the auction, and um, Bobby wants in there so bad um, with the new peahens and possibly the peacock. Let me show you what he's been doing nonstop for the last two or three days since the auction. He comes over here right next to uh, the pen where the females can see him and just struts and shows off the whole time. Check this out. You can see him want we'll to get close with this camera. <laughs> he's just strutting. Look, he's going crazy over there. He's doing his little dance. Oh. Look at him. So these two, Bobby and our new peacock, have been going back and forth. But literally, Bobby has just been going right there. He'll sit there all day long and just strut his stuff. Just strut it. So um, we put, we're going to leave him in here for a, probably a good month. Um, or if we get something built before then, you know, we they have to be enclosed for at least a month, if not longer, so they won't run off. But I want to, so I actually want to build an enclosure just for the peacocks and peahens. I love Bobby running around. With our past experience with peahens, they always, we've had two over the last couple of years since we've had Bobby, and they come up missing. They either run off or they just vanish, disappear. And um, we want these ones to be layers. I've actually got one egg in the incubator. I'll show you guys that. And I got one in there I gotta go get. Um, so they've, la they've laid two eggs in three days. Bobby is still showing off. Shake it, Bobby. Shake it. Shake it, Bob. Shake it. So I think maybe in one of Brandy's videos, I wanna put him in there with these, these ones. And if they start going at it, I'll get in there and get Bobby out. But I want him to be introduced to the females shortly, soon. Maybe this week sometime. We'll see. Hey, Bobby. Watch out, Bobby. So I need to get in there and get that egg before they break it. And we're going to be hatching out some little ones, hopefully. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? You guys making yourself at home? Okay, okay. All right, so he's been going at it with him too. I gotta try to get out. I'm not trying to scare, scare you. I just need to get this egg before you break it. <clears throat> now I think I'm gonna make a little nest box for him because these eggs are getting dirty. Okay, hey, how you doing? How you doing? Hmm? What's up ladies? You're pretty docile. They're getting used to us, I think. They're getting used to us. Isn't he cool looking? I haven't got to see him fan out because there's really no room in here for him to fan out and show off. Hmm. Pretty cool though, huh? Look at this one. Wiped off. Put in the incubator. Let's see if I can get out of here. What are you doing, girl? You can't have this egg. This is a very expensive egg. I'm Bobby. Doesn't have your genetics yet. So the guy at the auction told us that they would be laying eggs, and over the next, the first week, they'll still be fertile from um, the expensive peacock he had in with that particular female. And um, he said it was already laying. So that's two eggs. I'm assuming it's from the same one. Uh, but I'm gonna get. I'm gonna go put this in the house. I'll show you the other egg. Then we need to get some straw in here or some hay in here for them to sit on. Come on, Gabby. Come on, Gracie. Bobby, we'll be back. We'll be back, Bob. Promise. Okay. I kind of brushed this off a little bit. This egg, particular egg. It looks smaller than the last one. I didn't want to wash it all the way off the water because it has that protective layer on it. I think you have to keep it on there. But let's move this out of the way. So 
So there's the last peacock egg from a couple days ago. This one actually looks a little bit smaller. I need to do some moving. Now these are the these are a couple turkey eggs. I don't know. These got cold because we had to go buy this little incubator. So we don't know for sure how these eggs are doing. We need, to, we need to candle them tonight to check. Usually I wouldn't put a dirty egg in there, but since it's a peacock egg, I don't know. We'll see. What's up, Bob? We got a lot of rain over the last few days still here. So I want to make a little nest. I thought I had a little, I'm not throwing it away, old water. I could have put some hay in for them to sit in, but I do not see that anywhere. So let me get some uh, hay out of here and we'll just set it in one of the corners in there for them. Oh look, one laid egg right there. Get it Gabby. Get it. She just found an egg. Get it. Oh. <laughs> she got it. You got it, didn't you? She's gonna go there and eat it. You want one too? You better find one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is that noise? That's a weird noise. Who's making that noise? Who was that? Was it you, Randy, the roof stank, Randy? Who was that? That was odd. So one thing I haven't addressed yet is uh, Tucker the turkey. And he's not chasing me, he's not attacking me. It has been honestly a relief over the last three days coming out here to feed and water and not have to worry about a turkey if he's gonna attack you. It's been awesome. I'll tell you how much we got for him here in just a minute. Let's see if I can get in here. Need to make a little nest box for him, but right now this will do. Let's put it over here in this corner. Watch out. There. Maybe she'll use it. We'll see. Will you use it? Hmm? You're okay. I'm not going to hurt you. Get back. I don't want you getting out. Don't, don't escape. If she escapes, we won't catch her. No way we're catching her if she gets out. Any of them. Okay, so... Guess down in the comment section how much Tucker went for. And at this point, I would have gave him away. If someone I knew locally wanted him, I would have gave him to him. So if you guessed $100, you're wrong. <laughs> if you guessed $50, you're getting closer. He brought, hold on. He brought 30 bucks. And the, the auction will get a percentage of that. You know what? I'm perfectly okay with that. I didn't have to kill the pet or anything like that. He went to someone else's house and someone else can use them any way they feel fit. Yeah, so 30 bucks for a one-year-old turkey. And uh, that's a little low, but probably good because it's actually probably not bad because I guess it's considered a meat bird anyways. And uh, I had a buddy that wanted to eat him, but uh, Brandy and the girl said no. This, at least this way, we, we don't really know, so... We don't know if he's just gonna live his life out on a farm or if someone's already eating him. Either way, I don't care. I mean, I, I started to despise that turkey um, because all he would do was attack, attack, attack. Okay, so I got Hopi with me and I wanna talk to you guys real quick about Tucker. Nope, oh, right now here. Tucker was doing all the attacking. He was going crazy on me. Did he ever attack you? Only once. Only one time? He started going after mom. He would go after me every single time. Then he started going after Brandy and then got you once. 
don't know if you ever got Hadley. So how, Hadley. Did he? Okay, so there you go. Because me and Hadley used that white bucket, and he thought it was a turkey. Oh, so he would he would all it was it was never ending, like literally terrorizing. And the one thing I said earlier that I have noticed has been three days. Actually, it's been a little longer than three days because he went like a day or two before. It's been like it's been like five days since we've had him on, mm -hmm. and um, it is a relief. I don't have to come out here and worry about a big turkey coming after us. But mom said you was a little sad about it. Yeah. Were you? Yeah, there's bugs biting me. Is he getting bu bit by bugs? What are you? Uh, so you were a little sad about it? Yeah. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> but are you over it yet? Yeah. He's not attacking us, so I'm over turtle. it. Yep, we still have the turtle in there. So uh, we got two eggs in the incubator. Mm -hmm. Let's check that little nest I put in there. Okay. You haven't seen that yet. So Hope has not seen. I don't know if they laid in there or not. Nope. Well, they may have. That's a good nest. I think one of them, I think one actually did lay in it. I'll There's no ahead. eggs yet. No, you, okay, you can check it real quick. I just did it a few hours ago. Sometimes they bury it. What's up, Hadley? Hey, no. No, no, Gabby. I, I want to see if I can pet the peacock. Okay. Or the, one of the girls. Don't get poop on you. They did, someone, one of them did lay on that. See how it's all smashed down? Yeah. Let me put it back up. No, leave just like that because they made a little nest tray, so maybe she'll lay in it tomorrow. Yeah. Will he let you pet him? I'm he is. One of the girls. We need to clean their water out too. They scared. they jump in the water like a yeah. duck. Yeah, we need to get them that pool. Dump that water out real quick while you're in there. Yeah. Gabby, Gracie, move, move. You want to fill that back up for him? Yeah. Oh, here she comes behind you. Watch your head. Mm -hmm. Okay. It would be funny if she pecked me. Yeah. So we will definitely keep you guys updated on um, the eggs. I'll have to look up how many days it is. Probably about close to the same as turkeys. Um, but yeah, hold on. So stay tuned for Brandy's video because I think we're going to go ahead and try to put Bobby in there with them just to see how they do. I want Bobby to have some ladies too. Here he comes. He's been hanging out over here nonstop for three days. It's, it's funny. Um, it's crazy how he automatically knows those are my ladies. I'm attracted to them, and I want to get in there. And uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty interesting stuff, really. Here he is. Like, he is right there. You got it, Hope? Yeah. Okay, we're going to get off here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the auction and the new peacock and peahen, seeing those for the first time. And uh, we'll be showing them more in the future. Love you guys. Catch you on next video. Thanks for watching.